to the trains. This is a story about Bill and Ben, the twin engines. They worked at the quarry and they found it very boring. That one day something happened that made them realize the quarry was quite exciting after all. Bill and Ben work at the quarry. The twin engines were loved excitement and they often found the quarry boring. One morning they were busy moving trucks. Listen, Bill, said Ben. Can you hear something? What's that? That's nothing, asked Bill. Something different, replied Ben. I can hear anything different, said Bill. Exactly, half Ben. Everything is the same. Sounds the same, looks the same. What we need is a surprise, said Bill. What sort of surprise, asked Ben. But before Bill could answer, the quarry master arrived. I have, shown, I have just received a message from the fact controller, he said. He wants you to go and see him at the arbor. I wonder what we've done wrong this time, said Bill to Ben actually. Let's have a chef to say some. At the harbor, the fact controller is waiting for them. Edward is taking the children on a special trip holiday, he said. So I want you to go to the harbor station and look after his trucks. We'll do our best, sir, said the twins. And they wished away we would leave that. They hadn't done anything wrong after all. In office and they had side. When Bill and Ben arrived at the station, Gordon spoke to them seriously. You must behave here, she said. Where's your saying to away? You're on the main line now, not at the quarry. Actually, Gordon, giggled Ben. When we saw you, we thought we were scrap yard. Gordon was so cross, he couldn't think what to say. Just make sure that my coaches are ready for my evening train. He spluttered as he fumed away. Hmm, Billy went on exactly guard. The twins set to work. This will be easy, they said to each other. We know all about trucks, but we weren't used to the harbor trucks and the trucks knew it. We'll show you around, the trucks said to Bill and Ben. We want to help. Bill and Ben should have known better than to believe them. The trucks told Bill and Ben to put things in all the wrong places. Soon the yard was in a dreadful muddle. When Gordon saw what had happened, he was furious. You've locked me in, he said to Bill and Ben. Now my evening train will be late. The train moved some trucks, scheduled and killed. When the fact controller found out what happened, he spoke severely to Bill and Ben. I thought I could trust you to work with the trucks, he said. But I was wrong. Now go and sort out this mess. Gordon waited impatiently while Bill and Ben put everything back in its proper place. By the time Gordon was able to leave, it was very late indeed. Expansion was furious. Uh oh. Bill and Ben were sent back to the quarry in disgrace. As they began work the next day, Ben sighed loudly. Back at the boring old quarry set, and still no sign of surprise. Just then there was a loud rumbling. That's a strange noise, gasped Bill. I've never heard a noise like that before. I have, Miss Willis, driving nervously. It sounds like a rock slide to me. Then came the alarm. Danger, kill, clear the quarry! shouted the quarry master. Workmen scrambled into Bill and Ben's trucks and the twins pulled them away. Rocks were just beginning to tumble down into the quarry. Thank goodness we're here, said the twins. And there was all these people who have been hurt. They were just puffing out of the quarry. They heard a cry. A workman had left behind. Well, wait for me, he cried. Ben waited as the men scrambled over the fallen rocks to reach the train. He climbed the board and the twins pulled out of the quarry. Just in time, with a huge crash of hundreds of rocks, paired around the slide sides of the quarry. Everyone was safely out of the way, but there was rubble everywhere. At that moment, Edward arrived with the fact controller. Oh dear, said Bill, it wasn't my fault. I hope the fact controller won't be cross with us again. But he wasn't. Pois, o chef da estação final estava feliz com eles. Orgulhoso. Bill and Ben, fact controller, said. You may have a lot to learn about trucks, but you behave quickly and bravely in an emergency. 
So three cheers for Bill and Ben, our heroes. Hip hip hooray, cried Edward, an old workman. Oh, thank you, sir, said Bill, being called heroes. Well, it's it's, it's really a nice surprise, laughed Ben. So, please regard it. <coughs> the end. <laughs>